809. That was the 1975 right there with chocolate. Hey, it's the Morning Cruise Control. Senior Airman Kellen Carr here, and it's our third hour. And, of course, every Tuesday, 8 o'clock, we kick off the Power Hour with Power Zone Ricky in the studio. What's up, Rick? Hey, man, how you doing? Feeling super duper on this Tuesday, February 11th. 2014, two days before my birthday. Two days before? You're, you're born on the 13th? Yes. Really? Yes, I was. Holy moly. Now, every now and then, your birthday probably it falls on February, uh, Friday 13th. Well, you know, what I was about to ask is, is next year a leap year? I'm not sure when the leap years come around. It's every next four year, years. And every I'm not four sure, years? Yeah, it's every four years, but I'm not sure if next year is or not. If it is next year, then I'm not sure if my birthday is going to be on Friday the 13th next year. But Because it, <laughs> it, it, it could possibly be if you have that extra day in there? Yeah. Wow. I guess. That's kind of crazy. It's right happened there. before, and I'm still here. So it's all good. <laughs> Hope everybody out there in the uh, Yakota community and in the Kanto Plains is doing great on this uh, very glorious, not glorious, glamorous Tuesday. <laughs> <laughs> Well, you know, I'm going to say happy early birthday because by the time you get back on here on the 18th or whatever, or the 16th, 17th, whatever day it is, that you'll come back, your birthday will pass. So, well, thank you, man. Uh, happy early birthday to you. Well, thank you. And, uh, you know, I understand you've got a few big releases that came out today. Yes, we do on DVD and Blu-ray disc. And we'll be talking about that. And also, Ricky, of course, gives away a $25 exchange gift card every Tuesday at 8.30, so you're not going to want to miss out on that, folks. And again, that exchange card can be used at the NEX exchanges, the Yakota exchange. It can be used at any exchange, and uh, you know we can, you can also use NEX exchange gift cards at the, at the Yakota exchange as well, and it's, you know, so it goes back and forth, and you can use it on food purchases, so you, know, you definitely want a chance, you definitely want to call in for opportunity to win a $25 exchange gift card. Man, I wish I could win. Ugh. All right. Well, folks, stay tuned. We're going to be talking about these new releases and other events and sales going on around the Dakota Exchange and the Power Zone in particular. But that's coming up here in a moment. But first, we got the Imagine Dragons with Demons right here on Eagle 810. Pharrell's up next. From the Despicable Me 2 soundtrack, that was Pharrell Williams right there with Happy Hey, It's the Morning Cruise Control. Kellen here. And also, it's the Power Hour, of course, with Power Zone Ricky in the Eagle 810 studio. What's up, Ricky? Man, it's Tuesday, February 11, 2014. We got some new release DVDs and Blu-rays out there for you. I know, got some big titles that came out today. What do you got for us? We got Ender's Game. That's available on DVD and Blu-ray today. Ender's Game, excellent book and even better movie, or is it the other way around? Excellent. It could be both. Yeah, it could be. I guess. It I could. think it is both. I typically like the books a little bit better because, of course, they go into more detail. That, right. You know, but there's, you know, you got a 500 page book. Of course, they can't put all of that in a in, two hour in a movie. Two hour movie. Right. Exactly. So, Ender's Game did come out today for those of you. Uh, yeah, and sci-fi it, it looks fanatics. like they packed a lot of that book into the movie. I mean, if you if you see the previews, I mean, it looks crazy. It looks awesome. The special effects, of course, are going to be there. Um, it's basically about. Um, an alien race that invades uh, humanity, and then humanity, I guess, overcomes it, but the aliens are coming back, so they're looking for that next group of minds to help them, to help humanity um, defeat the aliens again. Again, yes. So, um, they're looking for young minds, we should say. They're looking <laughs> for young minds. <laughs> looking for young, feeble minds. <laughs> exactly. That they can feed off of. Right, exactly. So that's what the that's the gist of what Ender's Game is about. So if you're interested in picking that today, it's located at the Yakota Exchange Power Zone Department on DVD and Blu-ray discs. It's and you know if you if you're not familiar with uh, Ender's Game, you're a big sci-fi fanatic. You you dig the uh, Star Trek type stuff. You dig oh all man, that. yeah. I mean, that, that's, oh goodness, that's Ricky stuff right there. That sci that uh, Star Trek. But yes, definitely pick up Ender's Game. And uh, what else you got for us? It's not see, so sci-fi. We got the Best Man Holiday. The Best Man Holiday. It's been about 10 years, I think, since yes. the last movie. Since the Best Man came out. Can you out. believe that? That is crazy. Oh, my goodness. Time flies. 10 years. Yes. And this is, the, this is uh, who else featured in this one? Oh, goodness. You got, you see. Morris Maurice Chestnut. Maurice Chestnut. Yeah. Melissa DeSosa, Tay Diggs, Regina Hall, Monica Calhoun, Terrace Howard. They Santa brought, they brought the crew back. Nia Long. Oh, my. They, 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 mm-hmm. Nia yes. Long. Yes. Nia Long is back. Mm. Are Nia Long's in the movie? Yes. So they have the entire cast. Um, this one is is it's bigger, it's it's better, it has more surprises, more twists. If you if you've seen um, just a glimpse of what this movie is, I was watch I was watching a little bit of it last night, and it's 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 funny. And see, the people, some people might be like, "What? Are they, best Man Holiday is the sequel? Well, what? What? You know, if you you got to go check out the Best Man. Yes, you got to watch the Best Man. You got to watch the Best Man first, and then uh, come back and check out Best Man Holiday. Or you can check out Best Man Holiday, you, you and then check, go back and check out Best Man later. The so. way movies are made in Hollywood, you could check out the second one before the first one, but it's not. You're not going to be truly immersed into in the, the, the Best Man Holiday. Yes, or the Best Man. You said the Best Man characters, if you do not watch 
the first movie. So you can, you know, you can pick up an iTunes $25 gift card or whatnot. You can, and you can purchase it, uh, um, you know, on demand or, or through iTunes or whatnot. You can watch The Best Man, and you can come into E-Code Exchange and pick up The <laughs> Best Man Holiday. <laughs> and what was the third title you had released today? We have The Counselor. The Counselor. Yeah, we have now, The Now, this counselor. one I'm not familiar with. I know it has a, a slew of actors in it yes. and actresses, but I'm not f- real familiar with that well, one. Well, first off, it has Michael Fassbender. He he's he played uh who did he play in a movie? He played uh, the, well, he, Magneto, young yes, Magneto. Yes, he played young Magneto in the in the X Men First Class. Okay. Uh, movie in the in the upcoming movie X Men Days of Futures Past. It has Cameron Diaz in it. it has Brad Pitt, and it has it has a whole slew. It has a um, a couple Academy Award winning um, actors and actresses in it. Um, it's basically about a, he's play, he plays a counselor, but actually he's a lawyer, and he and he he gets involved in. Um, drug trafficking. Oh wow! And then it comes back to get him, and then he, I guess he has to get himself, him and his, I guess his fiance or whatever, out of it. Ladies, this movie for you, you know, got Brad Pitt in it. There got you go, Brad Pitt. Fellas, it's got Cameron Diaz. It's got so Cameron Diaz. Good with that right there. Oh yeah. All right. Well, folks, stay tuned. We're gonna have more from Power Zone, Ricky. We're gonna be talking about. I'm sure you guys got event sales and everything going. Oh, on. Oh yeah, we got something coming up with uh, sales. So we want to talk a little bit about that new and, special buy item. And also. $25 exchange gift card be coming up after the Pacific Radio Report, but stay tuned because we got your weather on the way. Here's your weather. All right, let's take a look outside of our Eagle 810 studio. It's currently 33 degrees, and the wind chill makes it feel more like 25. Today, you can expect partly cloudy skies, with today's highs being in the upper 30s. Tonight, partly cloudy skies. Tonight's lows are going to drop down to the upper 20s. And tomorrow, partly cloudy skies. Tomorrow's highs are going to be in the lower 40s, with tomorrow's lows in the upper 20s. Today's exchange rate is 100 yen to the U.S. dollar, courtesy of Community Bank. It is now 823. Got Power Zone Ricky in the studio, and we're going to be talking about sales. And uh, Rick's going to give away, what, a $25 exchange gift card? Oh, yes, sir, every Tuesday. That never changes right there. Hey, we got your Pacific Radio Report coming up here in a moment. But first, Incubus with Dig. Airborne toxic Ladies event right there. Ladies and gentlemen, this is Power Zone Ricky here. Here is your opportunity to win a $25 exchange gift card courtesy of the exchange. The question is coming right up. I didn't mean to cut you off, Ricky. That no, was you good. airborne toxic event right there. Was does this mean you're moving on? Hey, it's the morning cruise control. Kellen here and Power Zone Ricky in the studio. What's up, Ricky? Man, you know I'm I'm <laughs> just watching this curling on TV, man. The Olympics are on on AFN. Big shout out to AFN. Curling. <laughs> I remember four years ago watching the Olympics and watching curling and I was just like what is the big deal but actually when you watch it it's, it's like there's a lot of you know it's a, specific things you have to do it's actually pretty cool it really is three dudes trying to get this thing to stop exactly where they want it. exactly and they got to shave the ice to make sure it goes a certain way and how fast it goes you know I mean goodness gracious like that AFN spot I don't know if you've seen it <laughs> yeah, there's 20 pages of rules on curling. Yeah. Yes. Hey, check out myafn.net if you want to know what's going on on television. And again, AFN Sports is showing the Olympics, 2014 Olympics in Sochi. Have you seen all those articles of people talking about how big of a dump Sochi is? Yes, I have. That's kind of a. It's been kind of funny. Like the uh, the Olympians, U.S. Olympians have been posting pictures mm-hmm. um, of their their dorm or the rooms and yeah. everything. And uh, well, you, you know what's funny about that is I think. You know, you play sports, I've played sports. It's, you know, I think all af- athletes have been through things like that. Yeah. You know, when you get to a certain level, it's, I don't, it, maybe it, sh- it shouldn't necessarily be like that, but it's not something that they haven't been through. It's like I remember in high school staying in a, you know, in a cafeteria versus staying in the in, in lodging or something like that. So it, you know, it's understandable. But I think the biggest thing for them is, as, <laughs> okay, as, here we go. As Olympic athletes, you know, you come to Olympic Village. It's supposed to be like it's supposed to be like wow. Yes, it's supposed to be like Asgard. These are the greatest <laughs> athletes in the world, and you got living in just. You know, the Olympians. Uh, There's a reason why they call them Olympians. So I understand that. I'm sorry. I'll start being optimistic for a little bit. <laughs> I love your spin on things, though. I love your spin. So what do you want to talk about in this segment, Rick? Um, you know, speaking of the Olympics at the Yakota Exchange, and I believe in other exchanges, we have these United States Ooh. jackets, and they are fresh. I actually picked one up. They are dope. Yes. I've seen those jackets. You got one already? I got one. I got the oh, red one. Oh, I'm jealous. I got the red one. Oh, my you goodness. You get the blue one. I, I, I will. I'm, I'm picking it up. And look, next week we'll wear them on the show. Exactly. Some pictures in them. No, those things are, those things are really nice. So yeah. uh, you said you said they got them hiding in the back of the men's department, Yeah, right? they're in the uh, back of the men's department. They're where the football jackets used to be. 
Um, it's a really nice display, but they're towards the back. So you got to come through the back, see everything else that we have on sale just to get to what we got brand new. Guess what I'm doing? <laughs> on my lunch break, I'm going to pick up one of those jackets so they're not gone. And they're and they're very, very, I mean, the regular price is, is good, but the price that they're going through going for right now is awesome. It is. And it coincides, with, of course, with the Olympics. So, you know. Um, you know, social support for your country. It says United States on it. has some nice patches on it. There are limited quantities available, and we have them in navy, and we have it in red. Colors and of the you, USA. I know how some people are. You know, some people are like, oh, I don't want to be super corny. You know, like, you, I, I feel like sometimes people mm. are so, they're like too proud. It's kind of like when you're in the military, like before you join, before I joined the military, I wore all kind of Air Force stuff. Right, right. When I was in the process of joining. Now that I'm in, you know, I wouldn't dare wear something. I shouldn't say that. But, you know, uh -huh. people people will kind of look at you funny, you know, if you're wearing, like, Air Force apparel, even though you're in the Air Force. Because you're just kind of like, okay, dude, you're being too excited right now, right, you know? Right. And I think sometimes people get like that. Yeah. But these USA jackets are fly. I'm definitely going to grab one of I those. mean, it's cool. You're never too cool to grab a fresh USA it's jacket. It's absolutely ridiculous. Exactly. <laughs> 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 well, folks, stay tuned. We got a $25 exchange gift card to give away. Yes, we do. Power Zone Ricky is always being gracious on here, so stay tuned because that's coming right up here in about two minutes after your Pacific Radio Report. Ladies and gentlemen, now it's time for the Power Hour, the Power Zone giveaway of a $25 exchange gift card. And the question is... All right, the movie Ender's Game is out today on DVD and Blu-ray, India Code Exchange, or whatever particular exchange you may be at in the console planes. Harrison Ford is in the movie. Once again, Harrison Ford is in the movie, and he's no stranger to science fiction films. So, for your chance to win a $25 exchange gift card, if you can tell me who he played in the movie Star Wars, you will win a $25 exchange gift card. Now, you must be a winner, the first of not be a, a continuous winner for the month of February. All right, hit us up right now. The phone lines are open 225 2379 or 042-552-2510, extension 52379. All you got to do is say who Harrison Ford plays in Star Trek, correct? Star Wars. Star Wars, I'm sorry. <laughs> the character he plays in Star Wars because he's in the movie Ender's Game, which came out today at the exchange. So yes, make sir. sure you hit us up. Who did Harrison Ford play in Star Wars? We're getting back into the music right now. Powers on Rick still in the studio. He's not going anywhere. We're chilling. It's the Power Hour. Here's Katy Perry, Juicy J with Dark Horse. The phone lines are open now. I got peas right there with I got a fill in. It's Kellen here on the morning cruise control. And of course, this is the power hour power zone Ricky in the building. And Rick, you had a question you asked to give away this $25 exchange gift card. And people are shy today. They are shy. Well, go ahead and reiterate the question for uh, one lucky listener who can be today's winner. OK, for your chance to win a $25 exchange gift card, all you have to do is call in and give me who Harrison Ford plays in the movie Star Wars. He's in the movie Ender's Game. It's a sci-fi flick. He's no stranger to sci-fi flicks. Been doing you know, this for years. Been doing it for years. <laughs> you know, the, the first movie that basically Jeff started his career is Star Wars. So if you want to win the $25 exchange gift card, all you have to do is call into the Eagle A-10 studio and tell me who Harrison Ford played in the movie Star Wars. The Star Wars franchise. The Star Wars franchise. That's all you got to do is know who Harrison Ford played. 225-2379. Call. And uh, let's go talk about some sales going on at the exchange. Well, you know, each and every Friday we have a sale that starts in the Yakota Exchange or whatever exchange you may be at. If you ever want to know what's going on sale, you can go to any of our exchange facilities and you can uh, you know, check out our sales promotion flyers. Of course, you can go to shopmyexchange.com and check that out as well. All right, we actually have a caller, and I'm, I'm holding them right now since we're live. I don't want to take it live. You know? Okay. You never know what somebody's going to say. So go ahead and finish up what you're saying, caller. Just stay on hold right there. Well, you know, we got a, a big well, – we're going to have a demonstration up here in the Yakota Exchange Power Zone this Friday. We have a – let's see – a curved dynamic edge LED TV. It's a 65-inch LED TV, but it's curved. It's curved. It's curved. So, <laughs> and, you know, when I say curved, I mean literally that's what I mean. It's it's curved so that if you're sitting in front of it, it kind of gives – it you feel like you're fully immersed into the experience. It's, wow. It's 3D, and it plays conventional 2D images as well. It's an internet TV. It has a full internet browser, so you can – it has Wi-Fi connecti uh, connectability, so you can, you know, you can browse the internet. You can – Set it up, set up uh, an app with your smartphone so you can control the TV through the internet that way. Crazy. I mean, it's ridiculous. And, you know, we're going to have it set up on a 67 inch TV stand. And there's also a home theater sound bar. It's a, it has 7.1 channel uh, surround built into it, and it has a wireless subwoofer. And what's good about a wireless subwoofer, you can place it anywhere yeah, in the gonna, house. I was going to say, what's, what's, the, what's the advantage of that? What's that? Well, I mean, you're saving space. And, you know, you can put the subwo uh, subwoofer anywhere in your apartment, in your house or whatnot, in your compound. Yes. And then... Uh, <laughs> man cave. Man cave. You know, so 
and then it, it, it disperses the base evenly over you know throughout the room okay. um, and it's at a really good price really very good special price it's the first it's the best way to get this TV and have sound to go with it. All right. Well, folks, stay tuned. We'll be wrapping up the Power Hour here in a moment. I got to take this call we got right now. And we have your weather right here on Eagle 810, so stay tuned. Here's your weather. All right. Let's take a look outside of our Eagle 810 studio. It is currently 38 degrees. Today, you can expect partly cloudy skies with today's highs being in the lower 30s. Tonight, partly cloudy skies with tonight's lows being in the upper 20s. And tomorrow, partly cloudy skies. Tomorrow's high is going to be in the lower 40s, with tomorrow's lows in the upper 20s. Today's exchange rate is 100 yen to the U.S. dollar, courtesy of Community Bank. It is now 8.50. I'm laughing. Powers over here. I was, I was talking about the phone is like blowing up right now. Oh, okay. From the question, you, you're giving me that look like, what are you pointing at? Look at the TV. Look at my mic. What's going on? What did I do wrong? <laughs> we got 10 minutes left in the power hour. Stay tuned. We're going to have more Powers on Ricky. But first, here's Shakira featuring Rihanna with Can't Remember to Forget You. Eagle 810, who's this? Loren. Loren, how Loren. are you doing? Loren. Happy 2014. It's good. To, it's, it's yeah, great. it's good to hear from you. I've lost my voice. I'm sorry. Oh, that's all right. That's all right. You got to uh, answer for us. Han Solo? It is Han bam, Solo. Bam, bam. You are today's winner of the $25 exchange gift card, Loren. How do you feel, ma'am? I feel awesome. You feel awesome? What you got to do is tell me, who's your favorite radio station? Eagle A10. Ha-ha. 857 Gavin DeGraw right there with Soldier. Hey, we're wrapping up the Power Hour with Power Zone Ricky. Rick, as usual, I want to thank you, brother, for coming in today. Thank you for having me. Remember, each and every Tuesday, we give away a $25 exchange gift card at 8.30 a.m. You definitely don't want to miss that. We'll be here next Tuesday. Remember, out on DVD and Blu-ray, we have Ender's Game. The Best Man Holiday and The Counselor. Make sure you check out the Yakota East Theater this weekend. The Lego movie is playing. That looks really, really Uh-oh. cool. The Lego movie. Man, we grew up with Legos. Right. Everyone grows up with Legos. It's like Sesame Street. You, <laughs> you know, know what I mean? <laughs> Most definitely did. Again, Rick, we do appreciate it. And like you said, every Tuesday, 8 o'clock, it is the Power Hour, and you can win an exchange gift card yep, right yep. here on Eagle 810. Hey, we got your AP Radio news coming up next and our fourth and final hour of the Morning Cruise Control. Here's the Imagine Dragons radio.